This is the video for how to create a movie using video clips which was shooted in our mobile. I have already downloaded a video software. The name is VideoPad Video Editor. Just I am installing the software now. I am giving next command. The software is installing. The name of the software is NCH Video Pad. This is the interface of the software. In the first step, I am going to my desktop. Here I have saved demo 1, demo 2, demo 3 and demo 4. This video was shooted in my mobile and one audio clip also here. The loading procedure is just drag and drop the videos here. This is the video position. And the second line is the audio position. This is the audio and this is the video section. Now the first video is loaded here. I maximize the screen and I'm clicking on the play button of this software. It will play. This is the preview. The video is playing now. Okay. Now the next process is how to replace the unwanted audio. This will playing some audio in background. I am increasing the volume. So audio also playing. Actually this audio is unwanted audio. I will show you how to remove this unwanted audio in NCH software. First, I am positioning this cursor into zero level. This is the zero level and this is the audio section. I am right clicking on the audio section. It will open this window in the second command unlink from video click on this command and again right click on the audio go to delete option so this entire audio is deleted now now once again i am playing this video see this there is no audio audio is eliminated this is the procedure of how to remove the unwanted audio in video clip the next process how to join the another video clip this is the first video clip now I am adding another video clip I'm keeping the cursor in the end position. This is the cursor position, end of the video. Now I'm going to desktop, dragging the video number two, demo two. And this is the video position, drag clip here to add to end of the sequence. I'm dragging to this position. This is the second video. Now it was loaded here, I am maximizing the screen. This is the first video and this is the second video. I am enlarging the screen. 
this is the first video cursor is running and this is the second video this is the joining position I'm once again playing this second video See. It, this video contains of some unwanted audio the same process here also I'm clicking on the unwanted audio and I'm going to clicking on the unlink from video again right click and delete the entire audio is deleted now I am playing once again there is no audio the unwanted audio was deleted this is the procedure of joining the video now video is joined here this is the first video this is the second video and another option is how to add the transitions I will show you this is the transition point I will show you how to add the transition just click on the button these are all the templates of the transitions lot of transitions are there I am taking one of the transition for demo purpose. I am using this one cubic spin. Before selecting this, go to apply to current clip. If you select apply to all clips, the transition is added in all clips. So I am going to use only first one apply to current clip and time settings is important this one means one second the duration of the transition is only one second I am increasing to three seconds and entering in laptop something went wrong once again I am click on the transition and going to apply to current clip and I am selecting the cubic spin this one before the selection I am changing the time of the duration that is 3 seconds now I am selecting the cubic spin it will ask asking the final command in three seconds and distance of the cube this is in zero position and finally giving the command of ok no freeze now the transition clip is added here I will show you see this cubic clip this is the moment once again I am showing this moment is added here once again this is the position from one video to another video the joining of the video location this is the method and if you want any other transition again go to click open select the apply to current clip and select any other clips sorry transitions this is the preview of this transition I am selecting this one it was added here now see I am playing this is the style once again I am showing you see this this is the procedure of how to add a transition in between two videos and the next is 
how to cut the video unwanted video i will show you for example i want to stop the video in position here up to here so this position i don't want this position so how to cut this video i am keeping this cursor exact position of this video and clicking on the right button right click it split selected clips this is disconnected now right click on the unwanted video and delete the video is deleted now this is the end position of the video this is a procedure of cutting the video and the next screen i am again going to join in the demo 3 same procedure drag and drop the video location it is loaded here i am maximizing the screen the video is loaded find some unwanted video data is here this is the video sorry unwanted audio data this is the audio i am playing this video it was playing from this is the unwanted video also unwanted audio is playing once again i am clicking a uh, right clicking on this audio clip unlink from video and delete the audio clip is deleted and in next step this is the video joining position of two videos i am using a transition here using this one before that i am going to selecting apply to current clip time duration is 3 seconds and doors is selected this is a transition selected final command is okay the clip is added here this is the style once again i am showing you this is the style if you want more duration again go to same position change the duration to 5 seconds no face now the duration is increased see this now if you want low duration again click on the transition button and change this timings here one second i am selected and enter no freeze now i am playing the speed is increased see the speed next is how to add the audio in created video clip i am going to desktop this is my audio for demo this is the location of drag and drop your audio or music clip i am dragging here before that dragging this cursor point is important i am keeping this cursor point in zero level this is the zero level i am starting from here so audio clip is dragged and dropped here here some gap is there for closing of this gap right click close gap in track this audio is moved to zero position now i am playing the 
video audio is added and here also some unwanted audio is there the final point this is the audio spectrum this is the ending point of the audio i will show you the volume is goes to decrease and finally goes to zero this line is the zero i will show you goes low and finally it will goes to zero so this location is unwanted means from this position to this ending position is unwanted audio I will show you how to cut this unwanted audio I'm taking up to here cursor position and clicking on the right click of the audio position split selected clips again right click and delete the unwanted audio was deleted once again i am playing the video see this the audio is disconnected and if you want same audio for continuation here just right click copy keep the cursor in here this position and right click paste or overwrite this is added here see this audio is again added here this position i'll show you If you want again same audio just copy and paste copy and paste and copy and paste that is the procedure of adding the audio if you don't want this audio for continuation go to another audio i'm going to desktop and copying another audio This is the audio I'm dragging here. The new audio is added. Here some gap is there. Just right click and close the gap. It will closed. And I'm playing. This is the second audio. This is the third audio. I'm playing. the third audio third audio is playing now next how to increase and decrease the volume of the audio i'm going to keep the cursor in zero point and enlarging the video this is the end point this is the audio maximum audio here is the one speaker symbol just click on the speaker and this is the maximum volume if you want to decrease the volume a drag to minimize the audio and you okay command now i'm playing the audio is decreased entire audio is decreased up to end of this audio only i'm taking the cursor here up to end of this audio here audio is high 
I'm going to decrease the audio keeping in just position 2 for example only I'm playing the audio is too low and I'm going to in third position how to amplify the audio in the screen audio effect screen is there now opening this these are all the sound output procedure first one is amplification this is the gain I am increasing to 300 400 is the maximum I am using 300 and ok now I am playing volume is maximized now I am cutting the audio of the end. the video is ends here so no need of this audio the video ends here so screen is empty so that no need of this audio I am keeping the cursor point in exact location of end of the video I am going to audio section split selected clips right click and delete the audio and video both are ends here I will show you ends this is the procedure and next procedure how to add our monogram in the display this is the display of the video for example I want to add my monogram or emblem here this location go to add title select any options I am selecting the wave this one and I am giving a name of testing testing and this is the font style I am opening this one these are all the font style I am just using Arial black this is the font style three options are there for bold italic and under underline I am using bold this is the wave width I will show you in the video color I am selecting this color this is only for example I am clicking on ok button the color is changed here the video is starting here the selected clip is saved in video track 2 now the name is showing here in display testing I'm going to positioning this testing my monogram here I'll show you how to move this time I'm clicking on this one close this is the current position I'm moving to this corner left corner just move like this a dragging now I'm playing once again this is the procedure how to use the monogram and the duration of the clip is very low just three seconds is the monograms 
the duration i am increasing the duration little bit just dragging it will increase the duration of the monogram i am playing once again so this is the position and if you want this monogram up to end of this clip then just right click on the clip and copy positioning this cursor here and paste or right it will paste it here again paste or 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 right again again up to end of the video now i am once again playing from the beginning the monogram is displaying cursor is started from here up to here the monogram is displayed the monogram is displayed this will display up to here only this position because of the monogram is ending here monogram is ends here once again i am copying and positioning the cursor here and paste here again pasting paste or overwrite right. again paste or overwrite right. like this and again playing This is the procedure of how to add our monogram in the video. Next, I am going to show how to add scrolling in the video. In this segment, I am showing how to add scrolling in the bottom of the video in this location. this is also very easy method first i am keeping the cursor in zero position add a text option select simple text overlay this is the screen add the text i am adding this video is made for testing purpose and how to scroll how to add scrolling scrolling the bottom of the video sorry okay this video is made for testing purpose and how to add scrolling in the bottom of the video just select it sorry okay now this video is displayed top side of the video these are all buttons centering this is the right adjustment sorry this is the left adjustment this is right adjustment this is centralizing this is top this is middle and this is lower side i am selecting this lower side now the scrolling is positioned in the lower side and here also an option first option no scrolling second option is scroll bottom to top next is scroll left to right and scroll right to left final is scroll top to center i am selecting scroll from right to left and closing this
okay the scrolling clip is saved here that is video track 3 I'm show you I'm playing now okay this was in black in color I'm going to change the color of this scrolling double click on the clip clip it will again open select it and I'm changing the color red color I'm increasing the size of the font this is the font size I'm increasing the size up to 15 the font size is increased this is also invisible and once again I am going to altering selected and I'm adding the shadow selected white in color now once again I'm playing the video the white color shadow is added here I'm playing now this is a scrolling but speed is too high I'll show you how to reduce the speed of the scrolling this is very simple just drag the scrolling clip and once again playing now the speed is reduced this is also improper speed again I am scrolling for decreasing the speed once again playing the speed is again decreased again I am dragging the clip positioned cursor is positioned here I am playing once again this is the exact speed for readable speed and if you want to scroll this video on the top of the screen I'll show you double click on the clip the clip is opened select and here the scrolling position scroll sorry not this one this option select this option the video is scrolling on the top side I'll show you the video is turned to top side now it was scrolling here A lot of options are there once again I am going to double click and this is the center position I'll show you now I am once again playing the video this is scrolling on the center of the video now the video sorry now the clip is scrolling from right to left next I will show you how to scroll from left to right double click on the clip select see this scroll right to left next I am going to select scroll left to right now I am playing the video see the video scrolling from this side to right side now another option is scrolling, scrolling from top to bottom I am selecting this one before selecting this selection is important now I am going to scrolling top to bottom now the scrolling is coming from top to bottom side
This is the procedure of scrolling. The next session is how to add the background color in the scrolling. This is without background. Just double click. Select the video and here are some options are there. First is editor background, test background, full background. I am using test background. Select the color of the background. I have selected this color. These are all the color combination. I am using this color. The selected color is displayed here. For example, I am changing the color to white. See the white is here. I have selected this color and finally click on OK button. The background color is added here. Now I am playing the video. See this background color is added. I will show you how to decrease the background transparency. This is actually now 100% transparency. Now I am going to decrease the transparency. Here is the option background opacity. I am reducing the opacity to 50%. And click on OK button. This is the opacity. Now it was reduced. Once again, I am decreasing the opacity. Clicking and double clicking on the clip, opened and reducing to 20% and enter. The opacity is once again reduced. This is the procedure of reducing the opacity. Once again, I am right clicking. Next is how to add outline in the scrolling. Double clicking on the clip, selecting entire clip, and here is the outline. This is the color. I am selecting to this green or any other high, high color dark green I'm selected clicking on ok this is the thickness of the outline i'm selecting up to here and click to ok the color is too dim in color No outline is not added. Okay. Plus this chip mark is important. Uh, enabling the chip mark. Okay. Now it was added. See the scrolling. The green color outline is added now. I'm changing the color of that outline. Selecting this one. Selected this yellow color. And OK. Outline is changed now. Color of the outline is changed to yellow in color now. For watching the preview purpose, I am going to maximizing the entire video using this button, maximize. The entire video is maximized. I am playing now.
this is the created video So this is the procedure of how to create a movie.